Good day guys and welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how to remove the window wipers from your Jeep JK. Now this is probably be exactly the same from 2007 to probably 2018 in current. They might be exactly the same for the JL. They're pretty universal of Jeeps. Um, they normally run things exactly the same for many many years. Now this is very simple. Um, now you might be removing this for a number of reasons. Maybe it's broken. Maybe it's a bit rusted and needs to be repainted maybe you want to give a little bit of life back to it or maybe you need to take this little cowl um, grill part off here and get access to underneath here for whatever reason but today i'm going to show you how to get this off it's really simple um, a few things you'll need is a ratchet with a 13 millimeter socket um, and if this is your first time taking it off more than likely rust and corrosion has built in underneath this cover just here so a little bit of WD-40 is always handy to have on hand as well so it's very easy and straightforward with the window wiper um, obviously you've got two and lucky on the Jeeps they are very easy to get to normally on a normal car you've got the hood that comes up over the actual window itself and it's tucked underneath there now we can do this from the external part of the car rather than underneath the bonnet like most cars now what to do first thing is remove this little cover it does a separate piece to this piece here. What we've got to do is pull up. Pull up on it. it might be a little bit stuck. Um, just have to wiggle it a little bit. Pull up and pull out. And it's just a little cover just like that. It's got two little tabs there that you probably need to slide back and up. Pop that down to the side and you'll see your 13mm nut sitting there. Now our one's been off before but you can see it's a little bit corroded on there and it's a little bit dirty. I love to do it obviously it comes up through the bonnet if you're four wheel driving you might love somewhere that snows it might have salt on the roads or you might be doing some beach driving so a lot of corrosion ends up building around this nut. So it's a good opportunity to get your WD-40 give it a couple of sprays just like that never hurts let it, let it soak in for a minute or so and you can get your 13mm nut a 13mm socket and ratchet break that nut loose pop that somewhere safe what we got to do I like to do it this way should just have to go give it a couple of wiggles as you'll see there's a few grooves in there and it just wiggles out now if this is your first time trying to get yours out it might be already stuck and corroded inside these little grooves just here so you might just have to be a bit more patient with it mine's been off before you can see there's a lot of dirt built around at the base of the sleeve there where this actually pushes onto so you might might be a bit stuck so just give it a bit of time all it does is slide back slides on there and then with the pressure of the nut um, and obviously dirt and corrosion and stuff it might be a little bit rusted on there so just give it a bit of time wiggle it back and forward and just pull straight out you can see those sleeves in there that uh, will be holding it in and that's pretty much it you've got free access to be able to take this cowl off and just repeat the same for the opposite side and you're good to go now when putting it back on it's a little bit more difficult so pop that out slide that you want to make sure you get it in a position because if you go like that you're in the wind window wipers going to end up like there so pull it back down chuck it on if that's not all right you might want it a bit lower maybe it's in your vision when you're driving so you can actually adjust these so there might be another reason you might be taking this off you might want to adjust it so it's not so high you might want it a little bit lower Low on this side catches on that little bracket there, so I need to take it out and adjust it so it's a little bit higher. They can adjust a few different steps to be a little bit higher or lower if you want it to be. So I could probably do a bit lower. Perfect. I simply get your nut, put it back on. That's nice and tight. Doesn't have to be over tight. It's not really going to go anywhere, is it? It's simply. Oh. Put 
put your cover back on and you're good to go. And that's pretty much it guys, I hope this video has helped you when you're removing your uh, window wipers from your Jeep JK. If it has, please let me know in the comments below. If it hasn't, let me know in the comments below. Maybe I've missed something, maybe someone else's. Those need to be replaced as well. Those are starting to come off. So in another video, we'll show you how to replace the actual rubbers of your window wipers as well, because ours is getting a bit old. I might be able to take that off and give a bit of a freshen up of paint as well. But as always guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.